Let me let me do this method here. Let's try to grab the front. Let's see if I can slide it forward. <laughs> so, is it the best pizzeria on Long Island? Let's find out. I'm here at the famous Coliseo Pizzeria in Port Jeff Station. I've been here several times. I'm going to check it out again. I haven't done it in a while. So I am a little shy to eat this in the car. Cheese falling off. It's fairly greasy in general. It smells actually pretty good. A little rise in the crust. Not too shabby, right? I enjoy that. Let's take a look at the undercarriage. A little pale. I wish it was a little bit cooked more. You can tell right away it's a little on the soft side. Ugh. All right. There we go. Ooh, you can see the oil dripping off. That's... Mm. Sometimes I get these and I'm like, I don't know if I should get a knife and fork, but let me just push it forward. Let me do this method. Push it, the, the front of it. I do like the flavor of it. Not overpowering, not over seasoned. I wish it had a little bit more seasoning. It tastes more, you know, I wish I could taste more basil or oregano. The flex of it on, on, the, on it right now. You see that? I think if they. This is my opinion. I think if they put less cheese on it and baked it for a little bit longer, it would have a winner. You're messy. I think people like it because it's very nostalgic. It's been here for so many years. And, you know, it's a staple of the neighborhood. Very busy strip mall next to meat farms and a bunch of other restaurants and the DMV. I prefer my, my pizza a little bit more, less soppy. Oh, boy. Ah. Really? <laughs> Actually, I'm enjoying this one. I'm gonna give it, actually, let me take another bite of the second slice. Put that in the box. So, you can see I, I got the box because I knew that the cheese is gonna come over. It's not, it's very pliable. In fact, at first, I can't even move it forward to just to even take a, a bite. This is not tough. It's not an easy slice to eat in the car or an easy slice to eat overall. I don't know if you want to see that. You hear it? It's nice there, but it's not there. All right, there we go. Now, come to think of it, after visiting here several times, I think what put me off a lot was the, the poolish of the, the cheese. But I think a lot of people like that, and that's great. For me, I want to make sure it's easy to eat. You know, I, I think there's a lot of things you can do with this pizza, but I think they haven't changed it over years and that's how they keep it. There's nothing wrong with that, right? Small business, doing good things for the neighborhood, for the community. Overall, the score, I would give it, I got my money's worth $6.30. Reminds me of pizza, long forgotten, old school. There's a lot of people working there. Must be doing something right. Score here, I'm gonna give it for the flavor, nostalgia. We'll go with six, one. Click over here if you're interested in more Long Island pizza reviews. Click over here if you're interested in some New York City pizza reviews. Click over here to subscribe if you haven't. Don't forget to hit the like button. Uh, I think I'm going to uh, get banned from different restaurants. So far, been lucky. Knock on wood.